If you want to transfer data from your iPad to your iPhone using cables, I'm going to show you. Actually, you can transfer data from your iPad Files app to iPhone and also iPad Photos app to your iPhone. And using this way, you can transfer large video file size too. It works fine. I tested everything. It really works. For this process, I'm going to use my iPad 10th generation and iPhone 11. To do this process, you need two things. First, if your iPhone charging connector was USB-C, you need this USB-C to HDMI adapter. For me, I'm using Amazon Basis. If you have any brand, you can also use this. It doesn't problem. And if your iPhone charging port was Lightning, you need this Lightning to camera adapter. I'm using Apple adapter. You can use any MFI certified adapter also. Then second thing, if your iPad charging port was USB-C, you need this USB-C to USB-A charging cable. And if it is a Lightning, you need this Lightning to USB-A charging cable. I will give this all product link, Amazon link in the description. You can use that if you wish. So like I already told, I'm using iPhone 11. So I'm going to use this Lightning to camera adapter. And my iPad was iPad 10th gen. So I'm going to use this USB-C to USB-A charging cable. So first take your charging cable and just directly connect into the USB port like this and connect the other end on the camera adapter USB port. Then this is the only remaining thing and just directly connect this lightning end to the lightning port. Okay, now the connection was set up. Now what we have to do means just open the photos app on iPhone and iPad and wait until you see the trust pop up on your iPad. You need to wait 2-3 minutes. Before that don't unplug the cable and try to flip or anything. You, you need to calmly wait until 2-3 minutes. Yeah. Here you can see the trust pop up was shown. So just click trust and enter your iPad lock screen passcode. That's it. Now here you can see a new option import. If you doesn't see the pop up, you just need to disconnect this and flip the cable and wait 2-3 minutes again. Definitely you can see the trust pop up on your iPad. So now just click import. Yeah. Show all. Here you can see the iPad photos and videos are shown on your iPhone. So and one thing I forgot to do before you do the connection if you want to transfer files I mean photos and videos from iPad files app to your iPhone you just need to move from files to your um, photos app before the connection for now it's same let's open the files on your iPad for example I just open this and just select select all the photos and click share and save images now minimize this and open the photos app okay now here it's shown so now i just unplug this and connect again okay it's game yeah this time you can see the added photos too. So this is how it works. Before connection, you just need to move the photos and videos from files to gallery. That's it. Now, if you want to select manually, you can select like this and tap import. If you want to select all the photos and videos at one click, just click import all and you can choose skip duplicates then click import all here you can see the tick mark and here you can see the process of transferring photos and videos 
from iPad to iPhone so just wait until it complete if you want to stop the import you can use this option okay it's imported here you can see import complete would you like to delete imported media from iPad if you want to delete the iPad photos and videos after transfer the files you can delete from here for me I don't want that so I just click keep so that's it it's done I just I just disconnect this and same disconnected so I just open the recent here you can see everything was transferred so this is how it works this is the simple way to transfer photos and videos large number of photos and videos from your iPad to your iPhone even files app like your iPad files app to your iPhone gallery or your iPad gallery to your iPhone gallery or iPhone files app too so it's actually same process so this is how we need to do and if you want to know more videos about these topics watch this videos